Kia ora, year 12 and 13. This is the first question from Mr Clark's first scholarship calculus session last week. And this question looks really horrible, but like many scholarship problems, once you see how to start, it's actually really straightforward. And it's just applying what we know about logs from level 2. So let's look at what we've got on this side. We start with the log to base 2 of something, and that equals 0. So we rewrite that as 2 to the power of 0 is equal to all of this. Now that 3 is not 3.5, it's the only way I could get the equation editor in this package to do a time sign. So we'll just fix that up now, there we go. Right, so 2 to the power of 0 is equal to 1. So now we have 1 is equal to all of that. Now you may find it easier when you're getting the hang of these to write it out again with the logs on the left hand side. Lots of you won't have to do that, but that's fine. So now we've got that this equals 1. So we now do the same thing again. We've got 3 to the power of 1 is equal to all of the stuff in the brackets. So that gives me 3 is equal to log to base 4 of 3 times 5 to the power of 4x minus 10, take away 11. So lastly, I'm going to write it out again really slowly. Now I get 4 to the power of 3 is equal to what's left. So 4 to the power of 3 is 64 is equal to 3 times 5 to the power of 4x minus 10 minus 11. So it's basically collapsed into a level 1 problem now, but I need a new slide to finish it off, so I'll do that next. So that gives me 75 is equal to 3 times 5 to the 4x minus 10, dividing through 25 is equal to 5 to the power of 4x minus 10, so we must have 4x minus 10 equals 2, 4x equals 12, and x equals 3. Thanks for watching, I'll do one of the combinations problems later on this weekend.